reviews, I've got a public service announcement for anyone who uses YouTube, who especially has a YouTube channel. I think that that's exactly what this is about here. If you have a YouTube channel, please do not risk losing your YouTube channel by falling victim to a scam email. This is not the first time I've seen this email. I, I'm getting it pretty regularly now, a few times a week. Uh, excuse me, a few times a week. And I think anybody who's a little bit less savvy about internet scams, phishing scams, could be subject to losing their channel. And what would that mean to you if you lost your YouTube channel? To me, that would mean that would mean a whole heck of a lot. I would be in some deep doo-doo because I've been working on my YouTube channel for over a decade. Let me show you what the email looks like. Now, you can see it's the one that I've already read here right in the middle. YouTube with an attachment. Security alert. Okay, scary, right? That's scary. Let's click on it. Okay, it's sending to my, my YouTube channel email, Ryan at sillyreviews.com. The from name says YouTube. If we go into, and, and the subject says security alert. If we go into the body of the email, you're going to see the YouTube logo. Let's read this off. So far, everything looks pretty legitimate, and it made it through my spam filters. Now, my spam filters on my domain hosted email account surely are not as solid as a Gmail account. That's something maybe I should consider in the future, but for what I do, product testing, product reviews, things like that, it is more professional for me to use an at sillyreviews.com email. Anyway, back to the body of this email. Hello, we've received a complaint that your channel has lots of spam videos. Now, so far, it doesn't seem extremely professional in that first sentence but there's also no grammar mistakes there are no spelling mistakes nothing that gives it away that it's a chinese spam an indian spam anything like that indian um dot not feather okay please check and edit the spam videos we have marked by clicking on the link below now you can see below there is a link click for details let's keep going otherwise comma. So there's some punctuation there. You usually don't see that from uh, a Chinese scam, a Middle Eastern scam, a an Indian dot not feather scam. Okay. Otherwise, comma, if you don't edit spam videos, now that grammatically is a little sketchy. If you don't edit spam videos on your channel, your channel will close in 24 hours. That is scary. Thank you for your patience in this process. Then it says click for details. And finally, to round things up, we do have a, an address, a physical address at the bottom. I'm not sure. That looks a little jumbled, a little garbled. That's not as neat and perfect as it should be when you list um, a United States mailing address. Copyright 2019, that is the year. What is MO, Missouri? 4093 Wayside Lane. The comma is, there's a space, then a comma, and then California is crammed up on the comma. None of that is right. So that's a telltale right there. But really, if you're oblivious to this and you, you have a YouTube channel, especially if you just started a YouTube channel, you'd be nervous. Wow, what videos of mine are spam? Oh my God, I better click for details. Okay, I'm going to hold, I'm on an iPhone, I'm on iOS. I'm going to hold that link and it's going to show us where it's going. So you'd imagine if this is legitimate, it's going to go to your YouTube channel. It's going to go to a login page on YouTube where you can access your videos. Apparently, there's going to be some videos marked as spam that you need to handle. Guess what? YouTube handles spam videos, anything it doesn't like, anything that breaks their terms. It will handle them for you by deleting them, holding them, demonetizing them, whatever. Keep that in mind. So let's hold our finger on click for details and see if that's going to YouTube, to Google, or to something shady. Here we go. We're going to hold on to that and look where it's leading us. It's a redirect, tiny.cc redirect. Interesting. I'm going to copy that link. No, let's just go to it because it can't, it can't honeypot me, fish me out of my login credentials if I don't answer them. So let's see what happens when you click on it. Redirecting from tiny.cc and what domain is it going to, it's going to redirect to controller teleprobic.com and it's a 404 error so maybe this specific domain or host or server uh, there's been reports on it for controller with one l teleprobic.com 
if they want to make that scam work a little bit better, they probably want to put something about YouTube in it or Google or something in their domain name. But just stay on guard, ladies and gentlemen, because you don't want to lose this. You don't want to lose your YouTube account. You don't want to lose your YouTube channel. You also do not want to lose your banking account, your checking account, your credit card account, your home loan, your any your personal information. None of that. This is a typical phishing scam. Uh, that is used for all kinds of mischievous purchases, uh, reasons. Okay. So just keep in mind, you guys, my name is Ryan for silly reviews. I hope this video helped some of you out. I'm sorry if it's a little long winded and lengthy. I just wanted to go over it thoroughly. Okay. You know what to do. Like subscribe, share, leave a comment. Always love the comments. One more time. I'm Ryan for silly reviews and I thank you for watching.